Hello and welcome to the channel. To mod Resident Evil 2 and 3 into VR, first make sure you have the games installed on Steam. If you are modding Resident Evil 3, beware that the first few minutes has weird controls and camera and can make you motion sick. It's not a bad idea to play the intro in flat screen before modding, especially if you are prone to motion sickness. Alright, go to github.com slash predog slash reframework slash releases. You can find the link in the description below. Download these two files, re2.zip and re3.zip, or just one of them if you only want to mod one of these games. Now open the folder containing Resident Evil 2 on your PC. An easy way to find it is to go to your Steam library, right click the game, go to manage and browse local files. Now open the re2.zip file that you just downloaded. Simply drag all the files from inside the zip file to the Resident Evil 2 folder on your PC. Now do the same thing for Resident Evil 3. Open the folder, open the re3.zip file that you downloaded and copy all the files to the Resident Evil 3 folder on your PC. We now have all the files that we need. But before we can play, we have to enable first person mode for each game. To do this, simply start the games from your Steam library wearing your VR headset. If this is the first time you launch either game, do the initial brightness setup. Then point your right controller to your left wrist to open the VR menu. This is a bit tricky to get right, but you'll get there in the end. The menu will appear at your wrist. It won't look exactly like it does in the video, but have the same options. In the menu, go to first person and check the box where it says enable and simply let down your arms for the menu to disappear. You have now finished modding Resident Evil 2 and 3 and can enjoy getting scared shitless in glorious VR. Thank you very much for watching and have fun playing.